demonetization had an effect on uh, banqueting especially uh, for a for a resort kind of we have bookings prior to demonetization few got cancelled but overall uh, to be very honest it didn't have that effect on hospitality it happened an effect only on where there were cash dealings uh, we as in hotel we have all the uh, norms and all we follow all the rules and regulation so i don't think so that had an effect on our hotels to be, to an experience in sate right sate this time it was too crowded i don't know about uh, what is the potential but it was crowded uh, as compared to last year uh, last year it was pretty dull this time you f find people roaming here and there but i don't think so what potential will that that depends only that only uh, gets a heads up when we get business from them so uh, as a as a brand uh, nama uh, where do you see the brand going this year uh, we uh, as a brand nama we are soon uh, converting manumarani as uh, nama nanithal so we are again as we were thinking of we are converting into so nama will have two properties all together and also under the ds group we are opening up a hotel in calcutta under the brand name holiday inn express which ig would be managing as crown plaza at jaipur has been managed by them what is the marketing marketing strategy for nama will be again as you must have seen we been uh, rated number 1 by trip advisor uh, number 10 on uh, all uh, family hotels by trip advisor num in india where we rank along with uh, aman bag and the obroys as well as uh, high end boutique properties so probably we'll be again uh, doing as showcasing them these properties in other fairs as well as in print media and as we are also doing in on the online